People eating tasty animals. <laughs> PETA, silly gooses. Get, get the fish! Get the fish! Get the fish! <laughs> this week's episode is gonna be all about the ox man. If you're a fan of the ox, well, lucky you, because you're gonna get a full dosage of him as he goes to Montana for a family fun reunion. If, if you're a fan of Holmes, well, sorry. He's out. We gotta head up 300 and some odd miles up into Alder, Montana. It's beautiful up there. Where we camp? Not so much. I'm an outlaw to this family. The place we camp is sentimental. Not like it's nice or pretty or whatever. Sentiment. So I don't get it, but here we go. Everyone ready? Semi nice, semi desolate, semi. Are you sure this is the place? Kind of the feeling I'm getting, but we've made it to Montana. Don't mind these uh, women's glasses. I don't have any of mine. We'll show you the highlights of the reunion. Look at that rooster. I'm freaking believable. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'd like to see the hens inside that barn, if you know what I mean. Okay world, I made it through the night without dying. We made it to our camp. And today we're gonna go fishing. Not because I like fishing, because I'm there's nothing else to do. I'm here with T Dog. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, 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 oh yeah. He's gonna buy a license and we're gonna go with him. We've got a real fisherman in the back, Mr. C Dizzle. He's the guide for the day. Money Muns here in the back. I'm gonna go try fish with night crawlers. Apparently if you use night crawlers at work, but we're gonna go amongst some fly fishermen and really make them mad. Cause I hear that that's like not very cool. To, it's very uncool and it makes them angry. Hopefully the water's wet and the fish are on. First things first is we gotta stay legal. Gotta get a fishing license. At least Tyson does. At the Alder Market. Here in sunny, beautiful Montana. Nice little country store like back at home. Like old Emerson Earl when he used to run a store. Kipper snacks. Mm -hmm. What makes the red man red? Red man. Must have a children in his zucchini problem here. Look at this. So if anyone's down for a book reading while they're in Alder, Montana. Got the essentials. Doritos. Gosner's smoked curd for my pleasure. And the night crawlers. It's gonna be a great day. Hopefully we catch a fish because I really want to eat a fish. I love fish. And most fishermen, I don't understand them. They catch them and then they put them back. But with hunters, they kill them when they eat them. But with fishermen, it's like, no, no, you gotta catch and release. But wouldn't it be that way with hunters? Like, no, I don't understand it because I'm all about killing and eating. Here we have C. Hizzle, who dabbles in the craft of fly fishing because he's superior than most. Tell us what you're doing, C. Hizzle. Putting the line through the pole. I'm gonna put a fly on the end of the line. I'm gonna put the fly in the water. That's where the fish are. That's simple, huh? And fish like food, right? Fish are friends. Food. Preparing for the fly fishing. Catch and release. No. Freaking eat them. T Dog's gonna catch and eat them. Aren't you, T Dog? I kill everyone I catch. Whoa. And I hope I don't go over. Look at him bursting out those pants. Ooh. That's the money shot right there. This is some real fisherman gear. This guy's serious. Would you look at that? You don't even know what the heck you're doing, do you, T-Dog? You know, we're now at the worst part of fishing. Rigging the pole. Unless you drink. We don't drink. God, we need to start. We're gonna do this. Here's a story for you. We hiked in the Uinas one time we were gonna fish, and I took my rod and I took my tackle box and that was such a miserable hike that guess what I didn't want to come back out with it and so I buried it under a log so that no one would know that I left it and I left it up in the UN as by Dollar Lake if anyone sees a red pole there with a tackle box it's mine but now it's yours go ahead you can have it and I've never really touched a pole since but you know what I would do I would go deep sea fishing to catch a marlin or a tuna or something real big have them strap me in oh I would love that that'd be the best rigging the poles hurry up in the fish off between the 
real fishermen and the fly fishermen right now. The real fisherman's gonna have a hook in the water in about two more minutes. Look okay. at that. Okay, in the water. First cast. Look at that. You're gonna have a fish on before you know it. Yeah, we're just gonna reel this in now. I feel like I'm cheating. Uh-oh, there it is. Fly fishermen hate these people. Rod and reel types. I just hope we don't see a snake. Like, I'm amazed we haven't caught one. I think it was sitting on the bottom of the river. I'm hot. I'm really hot. Better take a dip in that river. Okay, new spot. Right here. You're gonna catch one. I'm gonna get it on film, then we can go have lunch and eat the fish. Whoa, the ever impressive fly fisherman. Nice his, backpack. His neat little boots and backpack. He's got a little net with his name on it. Such a long rod. He's so cool. He's so above T-Dog and his rod and reel type. Well, see you later. We're gonna catch 17 before you catch even four. How's the water? Wet? He's so cute, ladies and gentlemen. If anyone's looking for a net, this guy makes them. Old Sea Hizzle, he's a net making little dude. RockyMountainNets.com. This episode sponsored by. You're welcome. You owe me ten dollars. One, two. Oh yeah. Got in the tree. One. Oh yeah. Just like that. You pull, bring it to you. Yeah, just like that. Just like oh, the back. Yes. Set it and forget it. Just like the Ronco rotisserie. Set it and forget it. I wish I had a. Popsicle. Don't cross my stream. Here on the Ruby River, old C. Hizzle got himself a little nibbly nib. Let's see if he can get one up. Oh, you got fish! One. It's a good one! It's a good one! <laughs> yes! 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 <laughs> yes! Get the fish! Get the fish! Get the fish! It's a fish! It's a real fish! He did it! He did it! <laughs> Rod and reel, baby! Rod and reel! What do I do now, Casey? Club it! Get a club and club it! You've got to hit it! Way to go, T-Dog. You're the champ. You're the freaking champ. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hooked it good. It's only in its lip. Oh, it's bleeding. Blood in the water. Are you cramping up? Why are you? Oh, it's so hard. Why are you yelling? You're cramping. <laughs> I gotta get better. He's so old and fat. Swim the river. Did we have to keep it? Yeah. Oh, oh he's a fighter. Oh. He's a real fighter. Unhook that, little buddy. I knew it was easy. Hey, little buddy. Well, T Dog, was it worth fifty dollars? That was. That was worth. That get one. Get the camera on it. You know You're what? the cameraman. Watch this. That one moment was so satisfying of beating a fly fisherman. Worth it. You gotta measure it. How many inches? Oh, I would call it a 16. 17. 17 inch brown trout. One seven brown trout, baby, in the books. Montana Ruby doing it live. What? Ox here with his homies, minus homes, because he's he's not family. So if you have a wheezy We're stomach huh? or hate or hate death to animals, please uh, leave now. But <laughs> put him on the rock and club him. Clubber Lang. Hey, buddy. Sorry. You'll be missed. Oh, my gosh. He's dead. He's dead. He done dead. He's going to eat us, okay, though. Okay, give me, give me a picture. He'll feed us tonight. This is good. That could be my biggest trout ever. Montana, way to go. You got to kiss it. Kiss the fish. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's going to get some disease. I know it. Hey, ma, ma. You'd think we were in the Longhorn State. Look at that guy. Them are long. There's a ton of them. You guys know Bevo down in Austin? Cousins. Huh? Look at these guys. Look at them all. Oh, look, a dairy cow escaped. A dairy cow escaped. Way to go, buddy. You did it. Big sky living. He's way mean. That one's like the classic. Put right on the front of a Cadillac. She's a lady. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She's a lady. Maybe it's a non-binary gender beef animal. Yeah, let's not assume. It's non-binary. You can be whatever you want, even though you look like a bull. Look, America. It's a real moose. It's Rocky. There's a bullwinkle. Rocky. Remember Rocky and Bullwinkle? Hey there, dude, buddy. Just chilling and all cool, relaxing in the river. Very hot day. See you later. Okay, so Virginia City is kind of a lively place. A lot of people on a Friday, but they got antique shops, they got barn, 
cars. They got a theater right there. It's tobacco and cigars. Where do I sign? Boots Ox and shoes. Shoeing. Ox shoeing. Ox shoeing? No way. Yeah, blacksmith wagon shop and ox shoeing. We usually just come up here farther to the, this is why we come right here, the Cousins Candy Shop to my left. It's just wonderful. I'll take you to the candy shop. What do you say, girls? Do you like the Cousins Candy Shop? Show you around all the candy here at the shop. All this stuff is homemade. Can you believe that? Caramels galore. Eat. Wild huckleberry jam or candy. This place is a diabetic nightmare. More candy, more candy, more candy, more candy. I think I might have just gained a pound by all the smells. So delicious. Hey, nice hat. I got this board here called Old Fashioned Social Media. Delicious from Boston, Massachusetts. Hello, Mom from North Idaho. Ah, we made it. Look what here's in Virginia City. Ox in Virginia City. Blacksmith and wagon shop. Ox shoeing. Sea dog with his fish catch. Let's try her out. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Worth it. Tastes like trout. Glad you killed it. Oh yeah. Well worth it. If you choke on a bone, it's bad karma. America. It's fish coming back at you. Got ourselves maybe a fireworks show. <laughs> Sir, get out of my shot. <laughs> Just send it to the editor. I don't know how to take care of it. I know. I got it. I got a really good editor. Get in here, Barry. Yeah. It's Barry. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, goodbye. Thanks for watching. Now, if they can only sleep the whole way home, but I'm sure in an hour it'll be whining. Blessed trips. So, 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 Here we go. 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 Way to 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 go, sir. Way to go. Way to go. Way to go. Look at that. See if we can hear him.